What's up everyone? It's Pope Terry here again doing part eight, yeah, eight, of my Mass Effect 3 Leviathan DLC Let's Play. Last time, after getting lost on, on loads of ladders and stuff, we finally realised that that big beastie there is Leviathan. So I was right in the a river. Come on boys, let's do this. Oh Christ, don't get me. How was the harvester? Kill it with fire! This gun is overpowered, I swear it is. Alright. Calm down. Rendezvous with Cortez. I don't even know where he is, so I can't really do much. Oh, he's over there. Hang on. There might be some more stuff around here. I cannot deny myself exploration. If it means goodies. Pointless medkit. See? Salvageable data. Ammo. See, it's all worth it. Where are you going? Off we go. Get me off this shitty planet. I think so. I blacked out. Leviathan took control of you. We cut the connection before you got hurt. Leviathan itself? That's incredible. The Reapers seem as interested in it as we are. Yeah, it certainly seems that way. We were hoping you could help us figure out why. But first... Doctor, I have some bad news. Anne, please. Suppose Leviathan's broken away from the other Reapers, never went back to dark space, like a rogue, or even a defector. I have to call my father. He'll want to know. Anne, you need to listen to me, okay? Your father... is dead. I'm sorry. He's... what? Dead? He can't be dead. We met with him. Hoping to find out what he knew. Something happened. Something happened? And you're not the first to lose control. Your father's assistant. One minute he was fine, the next... He drew a gun on your father. I couldn't stop him. I can't believe this. We have to find out what's behind it all. You're the only one who can help us. And? I... I, I want to see his office. We'll arrange for transportation. Meet you there. No, not more loading screens. Damn you, Mass Effect. Ooh, achievement. That means I got now three, two, one. I don't know. I didn't even know there was DLC achievements. Giddy up. Load. Stop wasting my time. What bit is next? Is it the underwater one? That looks fun. As long as you can actually like do some underwater stuff, not just it being just a cutscene. That would be disappointing. Where do I have to go now? Check my emails. Nothing. Good. Where do we go? Do we go back to the lab? I don't think I'm going to be up for that. We Just go back, Terry. Uh, it's all the way over there. My ship will empty, empty itself. It will run out of fuel. No, it won't. See, yep. 
back. Here we go. Bryson's lab. More loading screens. Marvellous. It's just what I want. This this let's play is basically cutscenes and loading screens. That's basically all it is. It's barely any gameplay. Why is Edie here? That's Nessie. Hello? Anne? Are you here? Anne? Oh, Commander. Yes, I'm sorry. Just, this is hard. Of course. Are you all right? Yes. No. I don't know. <clears throat> My father and I didn't leave things in a great state. An argument? Yes. It was trivial. A disagreement on how to file some of the specimens. I was mad about something else i don't remember what and i took it out on him S so stupid it's all right i can come back no please i'm okay seeing all this again he was so obsessed crazy sometimes i didn't get a chance to know him oh, sometimes i felt the same way he was a great man, a pioneer, but he could be distant. I felt like an inconvenience growing up. You sound angry. I was angry. Still am, I guess. But sometimes, he was so full of stories, he nearly burst. I loved that about him. It's why I signed up for this work. I can't believe he's gone. We'll figure this out. We have to. I need to know what's on the other end of that artifact. What he died for. We need your help. You're our last chance. You're right. Let me dig into my father's work to see what I can find. Anne. You sure you're up for this? Yes. When Leviathan took control of me... I remember being somewhere cold and dark. But my father taught me to never be afraid of the dark. And what's cold and dark? Water! What is that meant to be? What are we doing now? I'm still amazed your father got his hands on a piece of a reaper. He was so excited. Your claims validated years of work. Did you take appropriate steps to prevent indoctrination? Of course. It was completely shielded, and we all had regular psyche valves. But now, thanks to the artifact, I'm indoctrinated anyway, aren't I? Might as well be a Rachni drone waiting for orders from the Queen. You studied the Rachni? I wrote my dissertation on them. My father thought it was a waste of time, but now? It might actually help us understand Leviathan. In what way? We think of the Rachni as telepathic, but there's really no such thing. At short range, the Queen uses pheromones to give orders. At long range, she uses an organic kind of quantum entanglement communicator. Whatever Leviathan does must be similar. Entangling particles to stimulate neural activity. It uses the artifact to establish a connection. 
then it controls the mind of anyone near it. Speaking of the Ragnar, I saved the Ragnar Queen, so we may be able to come to an agreement. You can never, you can never go down chit chat. Need a hand? Where the dick did he come from? Hang on. Better pause that anyway. Well, that's it for me, people. Join me in next time as I begin to understand why James just appears out of nowhere. Also, go to my channel for more videos that you may enjoy. That's it from me. So long, farewell.